Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're learning about continuity. Minute Math, Minute Math, when you need help you use Minute Math. We're given this critical thinking question. Of the six basic trigonometric functions, which are continuous over all real numbers, which are not, and what type of discontinuities are there? So, the first thing I'm going to look at, I'm just going to think about the six basic trigonometric functions. Sine, cosine, tangent, cosecant, secant, and cotangent. Those are the basic six there. Well, which ones are continuous? Well, the only continuous ones I know of are the sine and the cosine. Sine and cosine have a basic shape like this, right? Kind of go on forever, and that's the, the basic function. Forever, up and down, and it's continuous everywhere. All the other ones are actually not continuous. That would be the secant, and notice I'm putting a lot of order here. Cosecant, and the tangent, and the cotangent. Well, the secant and cosecant have basic shapes like such. It has some like U things that go on like this, right? And the tangent and cotangent have some basic shape where it's kind of like, it does something like this, right? Well, what type of discontinuities are these, right? Well, these, we have a big gap that's going on. It's like asymptotes here that are happening and jumps, really. So this, or well, not really jumps, this is just asymptotes that are happening that are causing this discontinuity. So this would be what we call an essential discontinuity, and that's the classification of the discontinuity. So again, our final answer, the continuous functions are sine and cosine. The not continuous functions are secant, cosecant, tangent, and cotangent. But you can see, like I said, the graphs right here. And the type of discontinuity that is, is an essential discontinuity for them. I hope this video was helpful for you. And if it was, please subscribe to this YouTube channel and like this video. This helps us make more free math lessons for you and for everyone else. So as always, Thanks for watching. Minute Math, Minute Math, when you need help you use Minute Math.